Hey, just wanted to do a uh, unboxing video of the Nemo hull cleaner. As you can see here, purchased from Nemo Power Tools. So you just take the sleeve off. First, open the box up for you. So as you can see, I've got manual. Okay, there's some notes in here. Using your Nemo tools in salt water. Okay, a few little things there about your warranty, etc. And then the manual right here as well. Okay. Uh, got a little package here which I've also got from uh, other products that I've got from Nemo Power Tools. So it's just like a little rag. After you've finished washing your tool, like uh, after you come out of the salt water, wipe your tools down, rinse them in fresh water and wipe them down. And just in case you want to keep anything else while you're out, out and about on the water. So there's the hull cleaner itself. So it's much like their grinder, but I believe it runs on different um, uh, different amperage, different amps. Um, so that's there, and then we got our 10 amp batteries. So instead of it being on the three amps or the six amps like the grinder, you got the 10 amp batteries here. Okay, so. That should just click straight in like that. There we go, I hear a little beep. Let me know it's hooked up. I'll clip it together. Just with those two little clips on the bottom. Your battery clips straight on. Now, turn it on, you got a little switch at the back there. And then high speed. High speed, and then turn it off. That's where you've got your little valve there to pump it up. Okay, so refer to the manual to see what you need to put in there with that one. Get your charger. I'll just pull that back, box back a little bit there so you can see. So you got your charger there as well. I've ordered an extra battery when I got mine. Generally it comes with only the one battery but I ordered an extra one just to have with me. So that's also your cable. Okay, depending on which country you're in. And then you've got your pump here as well, along with two handles to hook on either side, just to allow. So I'll put all that together and I'll do a video in the pool just to show you how that works. Okay, so I'll just, Move those out of the way a little bit there. And I just want to show you the brushes that I got as well. So, I've got the brushes here. I've got one of the red and one of the white. Now I've got that just so I can test the difference. So it's got a hex head there that then again goes straight in here like that. So that just connects on there. And then, You've got the white brush, which is much harder. Yeah, that one there, it's very nice and soft. Almost wash your car with that. And then that there is really, really hard. So I'll give them a test soon and try them out, but I'll just hook that on to one of the brushes here now. Just have a look at it. Okay, there we go, so we're hooked up. Go. Awesome, so I'll uh, take it out into the swimming pool and we'll give it a run.
give your tools a good clean to ensure a long lasting lifetime. As with any tool, if you look after it, you're going to have it for a long time.